On the outskirts of the gala And came this dude from France And revealed at all the wrong times He was handsome and sweet Used to meet a girl named Marie outside a palace, Iron Gate. The cages of silver emblems sometimes would wait. Another woman has flown in on a Learjet with whiskey and Bloody Mary's well stocked. Yeah. She was the caretaker for a would be king, never visited or explained. But Lucifer, he's well trained. He don't sleep much out in the rain. But every time I call him up, he says, send the big man around. With some misery intact. Those days we spent blowing lines on ecstasy. I wish they'd come back. For every innocent traveler whose passport has been pulled. For all your slaves and masters, how the passion does mount. But I'll see you, see you, see you, see you. When the springtime grows. Got you stirred, send their daughters off to the alligators and reel in the glory of a winning ticket box. How do you explain to them that her seat in parking lots? The loud singer who left her lipstick in the back seat. Not quite made it to the village honky tonk, where it marks the spot when it buzzes by the fountain. Revere used to fuss and fight here, they say. Always took the deluxe. I'll credit anyway. Turn to some Biloxi creeper. I was up on the bags of the lobby and listen to Moon River. Getting their little lights off, fancy tobacco and chess balls made from silver jewels. Used to frequent the masquerade scene in Long Island, where many a couple would abandon their porches with a jet set, a barrel, a real decent sludge.
salute. Something, something. Oh, we salute. We salute the mayors of Chrysler. The... Yo, yo, they used to meet right over there. song called Sunday Choir. We're glad to be here tonight. We are Tyler and the Names coming to you from the warm igloo of WHRB. And we're going to do a number for you now called The Pigeon Song about all of you who are flying above the ground tonight. Giving sweets to that man out in the pasture. Get your lunch. Yeah, let's go there. 
chateau I want a grace that's coming down like halo You know the lover had just walked on out the door He couldn't take a little bit more Some bikers took him out to a field. Some smothering dope was passed around on a Triumph motorcycle. He got himself together all right. But last time I saw him was a few weeks back. He was rectified, boy. You were standing, dressed in blue, walking along the avenue. Like, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you. Yeah, sometimes I feel like a lady. Take a little trip, run around to the countryside. Think I need to take a little trip, run around upstate, upstate for a bit. Think I need to take a little trip, run around in the woods. You run so fast you can't make nothing out no more.
when the trip is done, you're standing there next to your little runaway. number now to be called Salt and Speed. And I want to dedicate it to all the kids running around Harvard University tonight, trying to cop a little bit of the stuff that speeds them up. Because you got to read faster, you got to live faster, you got to be faster. And this is dedicated to them. You know it's coming close to the midnight hour. Avery Fisher Hall. Oh. I know a guy for twenty dollars. He can make me. Run real fast. Stay up all night. Stay up all night. Stay up all night. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta take a trip down over a few states over. Mm, to the orange fields. That's where the real good speed hides beneath the trees. That's where the real good speed hides beneath the trees. I got a loot of diamonds. The bird in New Jersey. Medicine man's gonna show up soon. Won't show mercy. I see a little kid in the 
back of a Cadillac car. He'll be getting home soon. Can't wait to get back. People out to be. number there. Didn't get in trouble with the Harvard security for that one. But we're going to do a number for you now about a van that's parked right outside here tonight. Uh, I think it was a uh, yellow, no, was it? Darn. Orange. Orange fan. It's a time traveling van. Got a hot tub in the back. Take you back to uh, 1975. I'm going to face the band a little bit more here. Sorry for the oof, on air distortion. But uh, anyway, time traveling song about the band, this number here. One, two, one, two. <laughs> Darkness for a brief glimpse of light. I've been riding around your house all morning, babe, and I'll stay there all night. I'll stay there all night. But the moment that I get in, I will probably leave again. I'm a coward and a liar. Scour the land all over. We already mentioned New Jersey, but you can scour uh, the heartland, the brainland too. Yeah. 
fan. I'm going to play a number for you now that's uh, going to take it down a little bit. It's called The Vanishing Man, and it's going to feature myself and Mr. Tim on the drums there. He's so happy. He can't get over it. He's going to play. Have you seen the vanishing man riding a limousine along 12th and Grand? The press was in an uproar about the lack of a scandalous love affair. Had he become a syphilitic? Had he lost all his hair? The vanishing man. Well, it's a cool Sunday morning and the vanishing man returns home. Sits on the couch, pours himself a drink, and he starts to think about a young reporter who approached him on the street today. What did she say? She said, who are you anyway? He said, I ain't no rap puller, miss, and I'm no contortionist. I've been doing this since 1931. Have you seen the vanishing man? Have you seen vanishing? This next song is a number called The Tower Song off uh, the album we came out with before the last one called Long Gone Carrier. <laughs> and uh, yeah, you can uh, picture yourself in the Mount Auburn Cemetery when you listen to it.
lit a candle in the window. Sending shadows through the countryside. The young man said, there's a train that leads you in the morning. Okay, we're going to gear up for you now towards a song of biblical nature. You may have recognized his name, the name of this song, called Judas. And uh, I think it's a favorite among the band. Ian likes it. You like it, huh? Yep. Yep, he does. He really does. You know, a lot of people have said nice things about it. But... Uh, we're really happy to be here on the radio, and uh, we're going to dedicate this song to a few people. I'm going I'm to tell you who they are. Uh, Bennett, Bennett, uh, would you like to dedicate this song? Bennett would like to dedicate this song to Modelo Beer. Ian. Everyone in the world. Tim, uh, he likes to dedicate this song to the cats of all sin. I dedicate this song to my mother. Oh. I dedicate this song to Mr. Muckle and my grandmother who called the station. Sweet dream cream. 
dropping off the clothes. And we close where it goes. No one knows, no one knows, no one knows. Fishy, he understood a gleaming. He sat by the road twirling smokes all night from a packer, from a packer. Shag, shag, man, you know. He was stood up all night, all right. All of a sudden, along the street came his friend, a fry cook. He said, man, can you fry me a few? Can you find me a few of them circuit wonders? He said, yeah, I'll do it all night for you. It kind of line. If you pull up the blinders. Come blinders, come You don't get much money. 
You don't get much mail down by the river, do you? No, I don't. I don't. I don't. It reaches. And it teaches. And it don't make. Don't make no Grandmothers are very pleased with that one. They taught us how to play it. What is what, what is what is the uh, the time check here on this? All right. Um, any requests from the band? Any numbers you want to play? I think we should do a, a bullfrog and a, and a Muhammad Ali. Which one's about to show us? All right. Uh, we're going to do a song for you now called The Bullfrog's Lamentation there. <laughs> I guess that's the choice. All right. You ready? One, two, three, four. The Bullfrog's Lamentation. It was of the rarest kind. Another dude in the valley. Never hear a cry or whisper from little rag dolls named Sally. When we walked into the barroom, to remember the stony glance. I didn't want it to happen that way, but what can you do? You bolted, scolded with your tail between your legs. After all this time, you got no right.
the last number we're gonna do. Short history of Tyler and the names. We met up when a three suited gentleman named Mitch Hampton turned a corner where a little hippie girl who I had been playing over the organ with in a ramshackle hole called the White House turned a corner in Edmund Square and he led me to a backyard where a drummer named Tim was playing innocuously on a skateboard, a submarine, or a Porsche car. I said we need a drummer for this new album, and he said, "Yeah, I heard of, I heard of the drums. I can play them." He showed up and he played, and I had to say, "Wow, you're pretty good, pretty good." He was in a band called the Blues Dream Box, where the blues and dreams are kept in a big old trunk, and all those boys came over to the Middle East over in Mental Square, you know, to hear some of that uh, incandescent, incantoy shit. And they said, oh, it's pretty good. Not too bad. And one day, uh, Ian said, you know, uh, you should make the operation uh, the Dream Beat Dream Beat Dream Blue Stream Box. Blue Stream Box. You should have the Blue Stream Box eat Tyler the names up. You should have the Blue Stream Box form a title in the names and the collective uh, that formed. And now we're playing for you. And then we met Sterling by the Oiving.
want to thank WHIB for putting us on the air tonight. I want to thank Sterling on the organ. I want to thank Tim on the drums. I want to thank Ian on the bass guitar and Bennett on the guitar. You know, some guys fight with their girlfriends in bars. Other guys fight in the back of their cars. But Tyler in the name. Thank you very much. We're tiling the names.